Austin P. and Central Arkansas will play the first game of the 2020 college football season. Hi, everybody. I'm Wheels, and I'm now going to turn things over to ESPN for the call of tonight's game. And the 2020 season is underway. Kick goes into the end zone. Field, he's the true freshman. And right away, Oatsfall is going to keep it. Pitch it to Evans. Evans, a nice block outside. And Evans has room. C.J. Evans makes a guy miss. And you wanted college football. First play. Touchdown, Governors. 75 yards. And Mike Golick Jr., how about that to kick off the 2020 season? Matt, it feels like we've been preparing for this game for a month leading up to this, and we could have prepared forever. On to kick. It is good. Now second and four. Smith to throw. Throws it outside to Winningham. Winningham, one of their talented receivers, makes a couple of men miss. Move. Smith again to throw. Goes deep. Lots of contact intended for Winningham. Smith steps up in the pocket, flips it ahead to Crossley, and he's... Smith, again, forced to step out of the pocket. That incomplete, and Austin P's defense holds Braylon Smith. <laughs> now second and seven, Oates fall to throw, looks right, comes back. He's got the ability to run, and Oates fall. Just packs a punch and he runs the ball. A fake does need this time to Harley. He's gonna throw. Old ball, ball out quick. Ball falls in. Snap over the head. Deeds recovers it. Arsenal on offense. Third and short. Crosley again tries to bounce outside. And a great effort for it on fourth down. Smith to throw. Forced out of the pocket, throws on the run. And right up the middle for Brian Sneed. Plays off, Sneed up the middle, owes his shoulder, and he's gonna get the first down for Austin through the first quarter. Oates ball to throw, off his back foot. Had Harley flag on the play. Third down now for Oates Ball and the governor's offense. And a quick throw over the middle behind his. And a quick handoff to Myers who breaks it off the left side. And a big gain to get the confidence going. Again, Myers in the backfield. And again, this time Smith takes it outside, pitches it to Myers. And that's gonna be relationship as they begin this season. Now third and nine for Smith, and again, he is forced to scramble. It is picked off. Jack McDonald intercepts it to start the second quarter for Austin P. Governor's ball. You'll see number 18 in the middle of the screen again. Their defensive coordinators said he was an old school Big Ten linebacker. I'm not gonna lie, he's moving a little better than a box linebacker. Great job flushing, getting pressure, and breaking on the ball right there. He understood the quarterback was going to be looking for a bailout in that check down. Breaks on the ball, makes a hell of a play. Turnovers, miscues on special teams. We knew they were going to be a part of this game, showing up early. Preece Smith told us that it changes a locker room, and it's changed the locker room for good. His own ball goes up top, and it's caught by Jordan. Two yard line for the Governors. That's Brian Sneed back in the backfield. And a nice cut outside for Sneed. And a hard run ball comes out, falls out of bounds. Sneed takes the ball off the left side and met immediately by Cameron God. Snap, came clean, kick up and good. As Austin P trying to find that rhythm. So that was a loss of three for Myers. Now second and three. And again, Smith forced out of the pocket. Completes the throw to Jack Short. And 
Jack Short takes game forced out of the pocket from this Austin P defense. Now third and ten. Smith able to stay in the pocket there and a good throw over the middle to Hudson. That'll be enough for the first down to move front with Cameron Myers. Smith, however, is going to throw quick over the middle and a quick completion going to be good enough for a first down caught by Dwight. Third and three for Smith and the Bears. He goes back shoulder intended Bears on the board from 30 yards out. Kick up and good. So the first points of the night for Central Arkansas, 10 to three. Old ball to throw deep. Pass nearly intercepted. Flag on the play. That impressive third and five for Oates ball. Forced out of the pocket. Throws across the field. Falls incomplete. Intended for Vin for Deeds' head. And that one low. And again, the snap, the issue. Deeds tries to pick it up. And the second miscue on special teams for the punting unit for Austin P. Tackled by Dwight Blakey in the Central Arkansas. Smith steps up in the pocket. He is brought down immediately by Matthew Gale. In a Kick up and good for Ray. And so Central Arkansas able to take advantage of the miscue to get 10-6. Oats fall. Pressured. Able to get out of it and just pushes it forward. What an effort finds Benico Harley. And Harley off to the races just off the other side at the fifth. Play fake. Pressured again. Able to avoid the pressure. What a block. In the game. Thought it was a good looking hit. Bryant Sneed. Oats falls, falls and fumbles it on the pitch as he looks to pitch it to Sneed. And Oats falls still down on the ground. But able to get off the field now. Braylon Smith and the Bears look to take advantage. Rolls to his left, throws across his body, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Nathan Page. Full season. So third and three, Oats ball. Quick shovel to Evans. So third and 10, 27 seconds left in the first half. That's just a handoff up the middle. Cameron Myers. So Oats ball and the Governors, they're just going to sit on this one and go to the half. I would take it just to have college football back on my screen. Grant Paulette kicks it off. Christian Richmond there to receive the ball at the five yard line. And Richmond has his seam up the middle. Takes it to the left side and a good start to the second half for Braylon Smith. They give up the middle to Kier Crossley. A good bounce outside for Crossley. Is Crossley a big run on first down? Early momentum for Central Arkansas. Good kick return. Second and five already in Central Arkansas territory. Again, Crossley right up the middle. And Crossley into the end zone. Touchdown, Central Arkansas. That's how you start the second half. Kier Crossley, 34 yards. Or just hand the ball off and follow the big fella. Number 75, the left guard, Will Bird, just clearing the way. And what a drive for Crossley on that one, getting his number called early and often to start the second half off. That'll make your head coach a very offensive-minded one. Smile awfully. Witten Ray on to attempt the extra point. Snap is good. Kick is good. In a minute into the third. Oates ball sets his feet, has the throw, falls incomplete. Intended. Great athlete. She was an all-star athlete there in Conway, Arkansas in high school and then went on to play volleyball and basketball at UCA. And so she was a prolific. Boy, he'll start looking again at Benico Harley's way. That a quick strike out of the backfield to Sneed. And Sneed, hard effort, comes up short of the first down. I give them just as good of an opportunity. And again, we get tempo out of the Bears. Smith play fake off to the right side. And that is a big fella, Jack Short. Second and one. Quick look to Crossley over the middle. Caught Hudson. And he's forced out of bounds. A light can He is smarter than both you and I. Oh, Aaron picks to Crossley. Ball still on the turf. And Austin P has recovered. Kobe Perry 
takes advantage of the miscommunication. P rather, Central Arkansas grabs it back. His own ball fires deep, ball position, calling for a flag. Just to share their stories with their teammates. More than admirable, it's necessary for there to be continued progress. Raylan Smith, the good pitching catch to Lawan. Smith designed run up the middle, has a couple of blockers. And that's going to be close to a first down as some Austin pick. Oates ball. Good throw. Caught by Harley. First down, centered down in nine for Oates ball and the Governors as he avoids the pressure and eventually brought down there by Jalen Bedell. Game starts with us. And this possession starts with Crossley off the left side. Kier Crossley, big gain on first. Smith left side, back shoulder, great execution by Lawan Winningham. Credit for the count. But the fact that they're out here playing is a big third and 11 as Smith again has to step up to the pocket and he's going to keep it himself tackled by a host of Governor's defenders. It's going to bring up in 2020. Third and six for Oates Ball. Quick hitter dropped and incomplete by teams. There's a quick play fake and a quick completion. Helmet comes off. Derek. Smith over the middle, caught and then dropped by Tyler Taps tonight. 32 yarder, kick is up and true to extend Central Arkansas. Room for that reason. 130 rushing yards for the Governors. Again, the handoff to the left side to Sneed on 32. Smith up in the pocket in a quick dump, second play in a row. He hits Nix, and that's going to be a full selves in a way that's paid off huge for them. See if Oates Ball has some fourth quarter magic on it. Goes deep on first down, has a receiver caught. Jay Parker, big play, move the check field. Fourth and four for the Governors. Oates Ball to pass, up top, incomplete, flag on the play. Pollard had it fall in. Oates ball, the keeper, Oates ball dives across the end zone and ties the game for Austin P. The quarterback who's been through so much lost for the season in this very game, week two last year, just snapped Paramount. Kick is up, snap is good, kick is good. And now the Governors have taken a... Smith escapes the pocket, quick give to Kier Crossley, who's had a big night. Crossley able to shake a couple of defenders and get out of bounds. That'll move the chain. So a first down for Central Arkansas, and again it's Smith, again he's pressured. And a great catch out of Hudson. Smith keeping the play alive with his feet, able to find. Pressure comes. Smith looks left, throws left, up top. What a catch by Tyler Hudson. Smith going to go to the end zone. Smith has winning him. Touchdown, Bears. We've waited for the star receiver to make a play and he made the biggest one of the night 10 yard touchdown it's underneath the ball even if it moves as long as he's got it clamped so because of the the magnitude of the moment so they will attempt the two-point conversion Braylon Smith rolls out and it's good Sam Camargo the two-point convert back 365 days a year, lived to play another down, Oats ball over the middle, and is caught immediately by Eugene Minter. Big play, first down, will stop. This is the game for Austin P. Designed run for Jeremiah Oats ball. What a play call by Tim Z. Oats ball. He's gonna throw it, gonna come up short. It's gonna be intercepted by Central Arkansas, and that will do it. 
And that'll do it for the first college football game of 2020. Central Arkansas defeated Austin P 24-17 in a great game. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll be posting a lot of college football content coming up in the future. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll see you in the next one.